I I have a basket full of Easter toys, kind of. Lots of blind bags. I mean, I have lots of blind bags. I probably should look through that. I was meaning to do Easter videos all this week. It's almost Thursday now. Easter Monday. What, what do we got? We got, if I do one today, it's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Five days of Easter videos. I think I have some Easter toys, too. I have a special box that I put in seasonal or holiday toys. So I have to check out to see if I have that one. Thanks for giving the video a like already, guys. Thanks for coming in and visiting. Let's do ro 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 roll call. Robe call. Um, Rachel's here. Rachel was the first one here. Way to go, Rachel. Yeah. Angel's in the house. Anthony's here. Aram is here. Joey is here. Joker Crush is here. Yo, brother, what's up? Um, I have, like, there's lots of toys in here. I mean, this isn't your quintessential Easter basket, but it's kind of my kind of style for an Easter basket. I got a, a little duck girl here. That was from, yes, was that yesterday's opening? I don't remember. And I got this bunny here. I guess that was from the 15th. And then I got this birthday guy in a Lego. I haven't put that away. And then I've got these parachuting aliens with um instruments this really doesn't have anything to do with my easter video this is just stuff that i opened up boobies gave me that thanks for sending me those and thanks beach fairies for giving me awesome presents on my birthday batsy's in the house blind bag guess hi everyone i got lots of toys today oh tell us what you got and angel says hi batsy Thanks for being so nice to each, each other. Thanks for being so nice to one another, guys, here in the house. All right, let's spin this around. I don't know what I'm going to open. You know what? Let's open up some stuff that I have just as decorations. I got these at the dollar store, and I, I'm just going to stick those back in the bag. I mean, eventually one day, maybe when I stop buying toys, I, have, I can just hide old toys that I have in... In eggs and stuff that I also have. Oh, this is weird. So it's foam, and they've glued it to the back of the egg, I think. So when I tried to pull it off, it looked like there was just a little bit of butt glue. So it was butt glued to this foam. I thought these were going to be maybe slightly better quality. I got these at the dollar ram. I mean, they were only a dollar fifty, but their faces looked really cute. But they are going to be much more fragile than I thought. But anyway, cute enough as it is. Yeah, like as I was saying, maybe one day I won't buy any toys. I'll get over my toy buying addiction. And I'll just put my old toys into eggs. And I'll just open them up like that. I mean, some toy channels actually do stuff like that. Oh, look how cute they look like in the basket. Okay, what else is in here? Oh, my nose is itchy. Did I bring over the thing? There was an egg. Oh, this egg. Okay, I just bought this the other day. I didn't haul my toys that I bought. But, hey, Steven. Hey, um, I hope I didn't call you Aaron, Aaron for Aram. Um, Val T's in the house. Wood, World of Nintendo figures and play sets. General Leah Star Wars figure. There's a General Leah. Um, what movie is she a general in? <laughs> A Power Rangers robot. Oh, sorry, that's my email, not yours. I'm going to close my email. I don't know why I have that open. Mail, quit. Sorry about that. Um, um, a Power Rangers robot and Batman Batmobile. That that trend, that new um that new Power Ranger figure that turns into the motorcycle is so cool. Um, I've got one of those new World of Nintendos. Um, this has really been rare one, but uh, I found all kinds of these lately. So I don't know how rare it is. Maybe it's not rare in Canada. But I like that Bones guy. I think people want that one. I think that was one of the first ones that were released. Um, oh, wait. Yeah. So I don't know what this is. This is... I actually have a toy haul here. I don't know if I'll show you the toys that I bought yesterday at Treasure Hunt. 
I actually found a lot of cool things, but not too many cool things. I mean, it's just, it, you know, it's post-birthday buying things. This was one of the things that I got in there, and I want to know what it is. It's made by Jax, and it's like a dino egg in something, and I don't know anything about this. Dino... If somebody wants to write all these things down that I'm opening, you can. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. You can get out some scissors. You get out some dino scissors. I don't know what this is. I mean, I, should, I could try to read it. It says dinosaur train. And I've never heard of dinosaur train before. I love Dinosaur Train. It's a kind of show on PBS. Oh, awesome. That sounds great. I loved watching PBS as a kid. Well, when we got cable. I think I've told you stories about how where I grew up, we only had two channels because it was such a small place. But eventually cable came to town and there are some really good shows on PBS. The egg is really nice. And oh my goodness. What? I love this adorable baby dinosaur. I don't know anything about Dino Train, but I think I have to hunt down some more of these cute, adorable baby dinos because there's, you know... You know what? I used to really, really love dinosaurs, but then I hadn't seen the Jurassic Park movies before, or the I haven't still haven't seen the Jurassic World movies, but I've seen the Jurassic Park movies now. Dinosaurs are jerks. They are not nice. I thought I liked dinosaurs, but dinosaurs are bad. They're bad babies. They're mean. This one, however, I can get behind him. He is adorbs, adorbs, a bulls. I have to get a, like a nicer tray that I can sit out here. Something like a nice wood box, like a pine box, so it matches the background. Do I have a nice background going on here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, don't forget to like the video, guys. Yeah, like the video. All right, and let's go. Let's um, let's put this guy. Let's let the, let's let this guy hug the dinosaur. There we go. Hey, he matches this egg. Let's okay, let's let's let this guy hug the dinosaur. Oh, no, that's like the pink guy hugged the dinosaur. Okay, all right. Let's 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 pop these aside. Let's get those. Okay, so here's something that I want to open and just decorate with from the Dollar Tree. I know that you guys got a Dollar Tree. These looked extra cute to me, and I just wanted to get them. Did you know in the Dollar Tree, our our toys are a dollar twenty-five. We have to pay twenty-five cents more for the stuff at the Dollar Tree in Canada. Um, this is a quality duck, though. Does it squeak? Oh, it even squeaks! What? I'm I'm really impressed. These are cute, 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 cute. And I have three of them. One. And, oh, they're different sizes. I didn't know there was a mum mum and baby mum mum, baby mum mum, baby mum mum, baby. Hey, mum mum squirts out of her mouth, and baby squirts out of his bum. There's black stuff on here. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Let's see. Let's see what other things I got from the Dollar Tree. Oh yeah. These are all my. These are all my Easter decorations. I really enjoyed your birthday video the other day. Hey, thanks for saying that, Batsy. That's so nice of you. And Aptosaurus. Is that what this is? This is an Aptosaurus. I don't know. I would have thought it was a baby Brontosaurus. That's what I would have guessed but I trust you. And then here we have a baby frog. Did you know frogs and, and little ducks are practically like modern day dinosaurs to tell you the truth? Hmm. Maybe most Easter animals are dinosaurs. Who knew that there was such a connection between, except bunnies. Bunnies aren't very dinosaurs. Who knew there was a connection between Easter and dinosaurs? All right, little frogs, let's put in there. I mean, because frogs are amphibians, and birds are what dinosaurs turned into. Let's put that egg up there. All right, that's what else do I got in here? Hmm. 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 Got LOLs. 
You know what? I'm probably going to open up. I'm going to open up. I hope Jaden's going to stop by because I'm going to open up some Ninja Turtles today. I don't know if I'm going to open up Series 3 or Series 1. I probably should open up Series 3 because I can still get them in stores. But is there another kind of egg I want to open up? Yeah, yeah. Let's open up a bunny. And when I saw this at the dollar store, so I got this at the Dollarama. Oh, it's just a coincidence that it says $1.25 on it. You can get things for a dollar at the Dollarama. Just it's just the Dollar Tree in Canada that things are a dollar twenty-five. But there are different price points at Dollarama, and things go up to as high, but not higher than four bucks. It's kind of like five below, except it's four below in Canada. My daughter enjoyed it at the Smith's Toy in Steve. Steve in my daughter enjoyed it all at Smith's Toys in Stevenge today. Hey, where where do you live, Rachel? Um, I don't know where Stevenge is. Is that is that in is that in England? All I know is that Smith's Toys has amazing toys right now. So when I was a kid. Wind up toys, especially at Easter, I guess because they're hoppy animals, were very, very common. And <laughs> this bunny sounds like a joy buzzer. And I haven't really seen or played with a wind up toy since I was a kid. Oh, yeah, it's cool. it works really well. Oh, there. At least it stopped making that horrible noise. I did not expect it to be this good quality, especially finding it at... Oh, it just... Whoa! Look at its thumping legs. Birds are modern-day dinosaurs, too. Yes, they are. Yes, they are, Stephen. You see how fast that's going? I don't even know if my... My, my pictures per second... How did I totally figure that out? Oh. Oh, cute. That's cute. Let's open up another one of those. I have to open up at least all of my main Easter toys. Just like something might happen and I'll never do another Easter opening again. So I'm going to get a lot of Easter stuff done today. There's also candy in here, but I actually just brushed my teeth. And the last thing that I want to do right now is eat candy. But I know that later. Oh, and it all, they also come in really nice eggs. So these are sweet too. And I think each egg, each animal came in a different color. Wait, did I just get two? Because I know that they made, oh yeah, they made a pink bunny too. And I had to get one of each color. I really like the Easter colors. I like pink and purple. You know how I do say sometimes that I don't like purple, but I do like pastel purple is really cool color. Hey, thanks for the likes, guys. You guys are awesome. My, um, oh, yeah, Smith's Toys is awesome toys now. I did know Canadian Dollar Tree is 125 from watching Dollar Tree hauls on YouTube. Oh, is that a thing? Should I do more Dollar Tree hauls? Our Dollar Trees never have the awesome stuff that I see the Americans have. You guys have way better stuff. But we're starting to get more things. I do like those blocks, the Lego-like blocks that they have. And, oh, I mean, I did find some stuff this time. What did I find? Oh, these these little animals are like, oh, he works much better. That, that little white one is like a little crazy. Okay, so I got this pink bunny with a purple tail. That doesn't make much sense, does it? But Easter is a crazy time. And then in another egg came this little chick. And it looks cross-eyed and funny. I don't like its eyes, really. Oh, maybe my, my white one is kind of defective. I can also see... I can see in the crack in its bum, I can see spring. See, I can just see in there. Yeah, I guess it's... My first one is slightly defective. It's just, it, get, it just gets really excited. Fun. Eggs. Eggs. Three colored eggs. Can I put all the candy into one shell? I'm at a weird... I've been really good with food and really bad with food at the same time. I don't know what's going on with me. I'm trying to... I'm, I always, I've always been really good at eating only good food. 
And uh, but I don't know. It seems to be okay. Though. Wow, look at this giant LOL. I'm gonna have to open up that today. But first I'm gonna open up all of these Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles because I want to find out if I have doubles because they had a special like Easter section. Oh right, it's still not Easter at the Dollarama. They had this standee, and in it they had amazing toys. They had they had Monster High Minis, they had Imagine X figures, not these ones, but they had older Imagine X figures from different series. They had Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. They had Power Ranger Mega Blocks. They had, um, it was great, and everything was two dollars, so it was really, really incredible. I'm in the UK plus um, Steve Ste 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 Stevenage is in the UK. My daughter wanted to go to Smith's Toys, so we went today and did my live stream at Smith's Toys with my daughter's help. Oh, that sounds awesome. I better check that out. Um, I love the toys. Smith, since Toys R Us closed, Smith's Toys has amazing toys. All right, I should probably give the number on these, but I guess it doesn't matter because I'm opening them all anyway. These are the ones you can get. I think I got one of each because you can see the codes imprinted on the spine, but it's still very hard to read. It's imprinted in numbers. And I got one of each number differently. I don't know if you're even seeing the imprinted number there. But I'm just going to open these now. So let's go. Where's Jaden when you need him, huh? Are turtles like Easter animals? I don't know. Am I really going to open all of these? Yes, because I have to go travel around a lot tomorrow. And I'll go to more dollar stores and look for these if I did not, if I'm missing one. All right, here's a bigger picture of the ones that you can get. The first one that I pulled out of this blind bag is Jaden. What are their What are their names? Is this crocodile? Oh. Oh, I think Mega Blocks are hard to put together sometimes. Mega Constructs. Oh, these were still these were still called Mega Blocks back back in this day. So I got the crocodile guy, the alligator guy. Anybody know his name? Anybody? Anybody? Ugh. Oh, they're really hard to put together. Ugh. Comes with stuff. Oh, he comes with like, oh, he comes up with something really cool. He comes with an ooze container. I think that's what it is anyway. Okay. Sometimes Mega Blocks are made so well. They're so plump and cute, like my Masters of the Universe Mega Constructs. Oh, he looks good. All right, and now I'm going to make this canister here. I'll show you that. I don't think any notifications happened today. Did you guys get notifications for this video? And then he can hold it in his hand. Oh, he's an awesome figure. I love him. I'm going to put his foot on. Does it say his name on here? No, it says a number in Made in China. I like that you can put him with one leg up. He looks like he's running with ooze. All right, let's put this up here. Oh, Nancy got a notification. Thanks, thanks, Nancy. Oh, Aaron, Aram got a notification too. Let's check out this other blind bag, see what's in here. Maybe I should split it up. Maybe I shouldn't just do turtles all at one, one, one time, but I'm super excited. I hope I got the whole set. I know that one person is rare. Oh, and this is the one that's rare. So that's a good sign. I totally should look at the code for this. This code is... Oh, man, I can't see it. I can't make it out. But April was super, super rare. 
one out of 24, I believe. I wonder if she's going to be in scale with He-Man. Let's bring this down. Let's bring these down and see if Tila... Oh, no, she's bigger. Maybe that's why I like these even more. I mean, I like the Masters of the Universe brand more, but these figures are made bigger, which is a good thing. Hey, Life on Yo-Yo, thanks for coming in. Thanks for the like. Yeah. I'm on my way to get Easter toys. Oh, see you later. Thanks for coming by anyway. Um, I've showed my daughter your channel, but showing her your live streams is the tricky bit because in the UK times, our live streams start at zero zero in the night. Oh, well, that's a sad story, Rachel, but... She can always come and watch them later. I don't know. I guess I guess people like live streams. I don't know if I like live streams. I just do them because they're so much easier for me to put out quickly. And if I record a video, I just want to edit it like so much. Oh man, she looks so good. She looks like um she looks like that that incredible something that some spy girl i forget what her name is she looks really cool i saw play pixies did a review of that the other day all right awesome let's open more of these that one was really exciting I'll still be watching getting ideas. Oh, don't get too many ideas. I'm a bad, I set a bad example for toy buying. All right. And this one is Translucent Raphael. Super cool. Oh my goodness. I love Translucent toys. I think they look so cool. Maybe it's because they remind me of like beach glass. These are super articulated too because they have bends in the knees and everything. And they're bigger. This turtle, this Raphael's bigger than He-Man. Which doesn't make much sense, but, you know, I can accept it. Oh, did I just break something? I heard a crack and then nothing happened. What was that crack? No, nothing, nothing seems broken. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Hey, Beverly, thanks for coming in. Thanks for the luck. So many toys. So many, so many fun Easter toys are opening. Hey, look at this guy upside down. He looks funny. Um, I don't know if, especially after my video yesterday that I made, I don't know if like building toys is like the best option for a video, but you know, you do what you got to do. Look at his head. Again, this reminds me again, Masters of the Universe has just made from Super 7. They made some figures in Translucent, but they did a little bit of painting on their face, which I don't know I really like. I would prefer it if there was no paint on their face, but I don't know. So they kind of look like these. Look, he, you put on a solid color red mask on them. I mean, he does look cool. And then he comes with his, somebody tell me, are these called scythes? I believe they're called scythes. And those aren't translucent, but they do match his eye color, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, he looks he looks kind of awesome. Like beach glass or rubies. I also love precious stones. I always wanted to have like a bag of precious stones just to carry around and dump out. All right, awesome. What's next? What else what else do we have in here? I should probably not put these eggs up here so you can see more of the prime toy choices. I'm going to put that dinosaur up first because that is my favorite thing that I got so far today. I have that translucent Raphael. Is that a rare? No, I don't think he's a rare... No, he's not a rare one. 
the two that are rare are the is April one. She's one in twenty four, if I remember correctly, and that um, the dinosaur one, whatever his name is. The Triceratops guy. All right, and then Raphael's the only one that I know the name of that I always remember. Everybody else I mix up. And this one is Purple Bandana Guy. And let's see, Purple is Donatello or is Donatello Orange? Did I, it's Donatello. It's Donnie. I am right. Purple is Donnie, right? My daughter watches my videos even every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday mornings. She watches my videos on her tablet a lot of the time. I love when children watch their own videos. That's what I think is funny. Wow, translucent toys like beach glass. That's the best comparison ever. I love translucent toys, too. Well, I think that's why I like them, because of that. Because they remind me of Beach Glass. I can't get his visor on. His mask. It's not a visor. Okay, there it goes on. All right, and then put this on. Look at the detail. Look at the painted detail. And the Whoa, I just threw his head. Got white gloves on. They look so nicely made. I don't know what's special about this one. I guess, oh, this is might be him. This is an alien, a space version. Oh. I don't know if I have to put things together a little differently. Maybe the instructions say something like that. Oh, yeah, I do. Can't put his head on yet. The one time, one time I take initiative... We can't see how his head's going to fit on with this thing. All right. Put this on. I guess that explains why he had the white gloves. I thought that was a little weird. But it's really cool that he has a head, and then you have to cover it with a translucent helmet. And you can't even see the head after you... But it's still, if you, I guess if you look close enough, you can see that it's in there. And, and, and he's got a really cool rubber, stretchy rubber belt, which I like a lot too. Okay. Um, hey, Jennifer, thanks for coming and thanks for giving the video a like. So good to see you. And Jaden's here. Jaden, I'm opening up turtles. So many turtles. Do you see them? Did you miss them? Did you see all the turtles we opened? Knew you would like that. This goes on the back here. This is an awesome set, by the way. Sometimes... Um, <laughs> what, are, what am I trying to Mega Blocks, Mega Constructs is a Canadian company. So sometimes we get them really soon. We get them before everybody else. I know that that happened with me with the Power Ranger Series 1. Um, but some things we don't even get. Like, I don't know. I've never seen Faker in store. Somebody told me that they found a Faker in store. But I go to a lot of Toys R Us. And pretty much the only store you can get these at are Toys R Us. I actually saw the ship. This thing, the Wind Raider, was on the Toys R Us website. So you can get that from Toys R Us, but I have not seen it in store there. You can get these on Amazon now, too, though. But for a while, the figures were very hard to find. Or some figures aren't as hard to find. But they just seem to have one wave available. Oh, man, he looks so cool. I love astronauts. I'm really excited... I have so many things, so much to tell you. I'm really excited about um, Rescue Heroes being remade. And I was looking up old Rescue Heroes like this one, 
and I found one on the internet that was from this Hero World line, and there was an astronaut one, and he is so awesome, and I hope one day I find him, because it looks so cool. Astronauts are always super cool. All right, so that is what this... Donnie, did we confirm that this is Donnie? Or is Donnie orange? No, now I now I'm now I'm sure that Donnie is orange. Mikey and I always for I only remember Raphael because red's my favorite color. Mikey is blue. That's true. Donnie is yeah, I keep going back and forth. Um, Donnie, Donnie is purple. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Valti. Thanks for the like, Valti. Thanks for coming in, guys. All right, let's open up another one of these turtles. Look at this. Somebody tell me what this is from again. This is Jack Specific PBS show called Dinosaur Train. I need to find more Dinosaur Train eggs. Because they look so cute. At least that one looks cute. Sometimes I buy one toy I, I, that and I, and I freak out and think how cute it is. And then I think all of the toys are going to be that cute. But then it was just that one toy. Oh no, I have a belt. What? I think they included an extra belt. And how come he has no weapons for the belt? Wait, where's his staff? What is going on? Oh no. Oh no, no. No, no, no. Maybe, the, maybe this belt just came out of the... <laughs> what is going on here? Okay, so I'm missing a piece. i got to make sure that it's not still lost in the wrapper. I knew that there should be a weapon. It is in the wrapper. I feel it. This is crazy. I don't understand why he has a holder that holds two things. That's what I don't understand, but maybe it's so they can use a generic belt. But he has his bow staff. And at the Dollarama, everything is being connected in my stories today. At the Dollarama, they have Ninja Turtle. They've got all of the Ninja Turtle like play weapons. So they have the scythes, and they have the nunchucks, and they have the, um, oh, the sword. But they don't have the bow staff. But actually, they do have the bow staff. But they have the bow staff from the live-action movie, which I'm not interested in. Or from the new modern look, you know, because it doesn't look the same. But I want the classic cartoon bow staff. And hopefully that shows up at the Dollarama eventually. And then I'll get all of the weapons. All right. No, it looks like he got an extra waist belt because... This guy's waist belt is orange. It didn't fly out of the package when I wasn't looking. And so this means orange is... Look, his underwear! He's got his underwear on! That's funny. Mikey Leonardo. This is Leonardo, this means. Ah. Leo. Okay, what's going on? Hey, Hillary, thanks for coming in and giving the video a like. So nice for you to join us. Thanks for watching the video. Oh, cool. He has some of the best eye paint that we've seen so far. Um, okay, when I tell people I watch toy reviews to relax, the look on their faces. Oh, <laughs> that's why I don't tell anybody that I make toy reviews I thought I thought it was Raphael who liked the pizza this one comes with an awesome pizza slice wait till you see this and nunchucks pizza slice nunchucks oh I forgot to put on his orange belt I don't know what this theme is this is in your underwear with a utility belt on. Oh, maybe he came with a belt. Do you think he came with a belt? Is that who the other white belt belongs to? Because everybody else has a belt. Let me look at the picture. Oh, yeah, it was his belt. I think I can slip that on over his pants. That's actually going to make him look cooler. If that's even possible. 
here I thought I got extra pieces, but in reality, it's just Raph's belt, which I probably don't have it in the right spot. Do, 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 do. Okay. All right. Let's put that on. Oh, the stands. They all get blue stands. They should have stands that match their figure color, is what I think. The nunchuck is a real chain. Isn't that awesome? Like, this is such a small figure. Even with the big figures, they don't always put a, re a big, a real chain on it. So it's kind of awesome that on these mini ones, Mattel sure makes good toys. Uh, Mega Blocks is a Canadian company. Well, now it's Mega Constructs, but it is owned by Mattel. I really like his underwear. That is the kind of underwear I like to wear. Just your classic old school style. All right. There we go. There. Oh, there's a bunny going crazy. So far, so good. I think I did I did well with my number hunting. Raph is red. Leo is blue. Leo is blue. Michael is orange. Donatello is purple. Oh, I mixed up. I thought Mikey was blue. I can't believe I never remember that. Oh man, look at look at Karg. Is that what his name is? It's it's like a black figure, usually, and he's so like not pink. Why is he like that? Why does he look like that? Why is this guy in a tuxedo? Oh, look, look on here. He is so much brighter. You can hardly see him in the figure, but in the picture, he's totally pink and way more clear. His robot head always looks really creepy. It's a really scary looking head. Am I missing some pieces? Oh, his legs are two different colors. That's why I got a little confused. He's so much more smaller ah, than the rest. I will look for your toy reviews. Ah! Raph is... Oh, I read that. And what else am I reading? Um, hey, Vanessa, thanks for coming and thanks for giving the video a like. For your toy reviews, more relaxing time. I mean, I'm not exactly the most relaxing person. I guess yesterday's video would have been very relaxing. Three hours of me making crafts. That was probably more relaxing than one of these videos where I get way too excited and start screaming and throwing things around and getting excited about your likes. That, that's not so relaxing, I wouldn't think. You know what? I haven't been watching a lot of toy reviews. I don't think anybody reviews the toys that I'm interested in anymore. Most people review the more trendy toys. I mean, that's what kind of what this is. But, yeah, weird. I actually watch YouTubers, but different kinds of youtubers i haven't never thought about that I actually discovered somebody today that was really fun she was she was a british person and i forget what her name is but it was a really cool video i liked it she does a lot of legos how many is this one two three four five six i've opened six one two three four five six seven eight do i have eight is there another one is there more in here? Maybe I didn't even, maybe I don't even have, maybe I didn't even get eight bags. Maybe I didn't even get all of the packages. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. How could I get the whole set if I don't have that many? Oh, there's another one right here. <laughs> That's scaring me. What if I don't have the whole set? What if this is a double? This one's really thick. So who else is really thick? 
That's why, oh, the chase one, the mystery one. It's either him or the alligator again. Wow, that's quite a glasses chain that your mini me has. Oh, yeah, that's from that. <laughs> that was from yesterday. Oh, yeah. Oh, except it's not the one that I thought it was. But it's one that I haven't opened yet. Does that mean I'm going to open up the chase one on the last opening? It is nighttime. Oh, here we go. Ultra rare secret. Oh, secret rare. So you can see the rarities here. We've got blue, purple, um, orange, and red, the colors of the turtles. And then you can see the different rarities. And it's, I don't know why they call April ultra rare and they call whatever this guy's name is, Triceratops. <laughs> they call him secret rare because they have exactly the same rarity. Anyway, we've got a night vision Leonardo. Can I figure out how to put on his armor by myself? He's got a strap across his chest, it looks like. That goes up over. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 I see how. Does that go under his arm? Does his arm go in there? Yeah. Oh, he looks really good in black, too. I like, I like the colors black and blue together makes the blue look really pop and it still looks like dark and mysterious at the same time put on his legs put on his black head about those toys that are at the dollar store the weapons i kind of think that if i do get them the scythes come in packs of two but the sword only comes in one pack, and the nunchucks only come in one pack. So I'd kind of have to buy two swords, and I'd have to buy two... Um, two nunchucks, two swords, but then I only have to buy one package of scythes because the scythes are, you know, two in a pack. And then I'd only have to buy one pole, but they don't have that yet. Or I don't even know if it was made, to tell you the truth. I have to look up online and see if I can find those play toys. All right, here he is. Here is Leonardo in his blue and black. Nighttime, scary, really cool. And you can also put his sword back here. But only one sword, apparently. He's he's blinged out. He's totally he's totally blinged out. Give him a like. The name is Leatherhead. Oh yeah, Leatherhead. And I totally I keep talking about the same things here, but I've totally found a Leatherhead like probably two years ago at the Dollarama. They had they it was the Playmates figures, and they only had him, and they had so many of them, and I bought them, and he's awesome, and I haven't opened those yet, but one day I am going to do a major, well, now they're classic Ninja Turtle opening. Okay, cross your fingers that I have the whole collection. This is a really awesome collection. Maybe every collection that they make is awesome, and then I have the number ones, but I'm going to save that for another day. Jaden got his turtle fix. Cross your fingers that I got it. Really kind of weird that it is. It is! I did it! Yeah! Yeah! I did it! The numbers weren't the same numbers that were online. That's why I was a little... And I couldn't really see them. They were so faintly stamped. And then the staff at this one dollar store, they were coming over to me and like they gave me a basket at one point and they wanted to help me and they didn't know what I was doing because I was looking at the numbers like this. And it took me like probably over a half hour to find them all. And then I wasn't sure. And in the end, I just gave up. But yeah, I got the whole set. Um, oh, well done, Jason. Hey, Val T, what are you saying? Um, Leatherhead, thanks, Jaden. Um, oh, well done, Jason. Bye.
Why is, she, why is she saying goodbye? Bye, Val. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for the like. Okay. Okay. I have to, um, I probably will be doing lots of toy shopping tomorrow. Oh, no. Oh, it broke. What? That's crazy. The chase went just broke. The crotch part came attached, come, came detached. I guess I might be able to glue it. That's kind of sad. Ugh. Of all of all the ones that are going to break, it has to be like the expensive one. The rare, rare, rare one. What a sad story that is. I don't know if I ever had that problem before. It's only a very small, tiny little place where it was attached and the legs are so hard to put on. Can imagine it happens all the time. That's what he looks like anyway, but that's also what he looks like. I wonder what number. I wonder what number this is. Is this the last one that I opened? There's no way of knowing. Can you see it? I can't see it. What I have to do, I have to like shimmer it in the light. Oh well, broken. That makes me disappointed. I'll have to open up something awesome. What am I going to open now? Hmm. Another dino egg? Oh, look what I did to these ones. I bought these a long time ago. I think when, I, when they first came out is when I bought them. Maybe not. But maybe. And they have... I wrote the codes on them in marker so that I would be able to tell people which ones I was opening. It's probably what I should have did this time because now I want to go find another one of those. Um, the name is Triceraton. Oh yeah, Triceraton for the win. What am I going to open now? Let's open up this five surprise. Five surprises always make me happy. Yeah. I love a Zuru five surprise. The new brand ones are really cute. I kind of don't understand them, though, because Shopkins all also makes the branded packages, but you also get a Shopkin if you open up the branded one. So with the, with the Zuru ones, you're like, it's just the package. But do you want to know something? The thing about the Shopkins ones is I really only like the packaging. I like the ones that are just... I just like the packages of the products. I think that's really cool. All right. I love a five surprise. It's probably my favorite toy that Zuru makes. Yeah. Can I honestly say that? I really like their new building blocks. They're like construction blocks. They have the really cool minifigures. I've opened a lot of Zuru toys. But I think five surprises are my favorite. Okay, let's see what's in here. Awesome. Is it bouncy? Oh, it's totally bouncy. A bouncy soccer ball. So cool. This guy loves soccer. Yeah. Yeah. Give him a like. Thanks for the likes, guys. And I guess I opened up the right one first because it came with the checklist. Here, what is this? Is this series one or series two? Or I guess it's not series one or two. I have never gotten toy soldiers. I would love to get toy soldiers. I've never gotten one of the balls, I don't think either. I have gotten some of this.
who are barf. I like the figures. I hope we get lots of figures. They're the things that I like the most. Oh, we got some stickers. They make the best stickers, though. Because they're all, like, they're just really thick and plasticky and they're like bubbly stickers. They're so nice. That is a crazy pizza monster. I love that. Reminds me of... And then we have another Triceratops. Awesome. Dinosaurs everywhere with my blind bags today, I guess. Dinosaurs are great. And then this one looks like it's a hamburger, maybe. A gross hamburger guy who's come alive. I like those. Those are like the best stickers out of all stickers in the world. And I don't mean the subject matter. I mean, they're really thick. I don't know if the stickiness works, but I'll never use them. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. Five surprises are so much fun. Hey, Beverly, thank you for the like. Yeah. Is Anna here? Anna, thanks for coming in. Thanks for the like. I don't think she's here. Oh, there she is. Hi, all you. Jaden, is. it's your day. It's totally Jaden's day. Okay, we got a car. One of the cars that I got in here came broken, but this one isn't. And that's good. And it's not pullback, but it's got really, really great, really great wheels. You know, just spun out. I like it, too. It's cute. And it sounds good. Don't you love the sound when I... I don't know if you can hear that, but it sounds great. Oh, almost lost it. All right, let's open more. How many more do I have? Two more. Come on, be a little figure. I don't care what kind of figure. It can be an army man. It can be a ninja. It could be a, a bug. It could be a dinosaur. It's maggots. The maggots are pretty cool. I've opened the maggots before. Look at them. A little bag of maggots. And they're slimy. And you can, like, stretch them and stuff. And you can... No, don't chew on them. The maggots are good. We're going to put the maggots. Put the maggots in. Put the maggots in the egg. For my maggot collection. Maggots? Anybody want some maggots? Yum, yum, yum. Chewy, chewy, chewy maggots. Chewy, chewy maggots. And we have what? One more. One more. Only one more. Only one more. Come on. Be a figure. Maggots are figures. They're like five little figure magnets. It's balloons. I mean... I didn't really want balloons, but here, let's hope it doesn't hurt. Don't you hate when you blow up balloons and it hurts you right there? They're so small. That's as much as you can blow it up, really. It's hard to tie such a small balloon. There we go. I did it. Oh, it's stuck to my face. Oh, that happened the last time. Get it off me. Get it off me. Okay, let's try another one. Vanessa, what's so gross? Oh, the maggots. Vanessa doesn't like the maggots. Oh, oh get it. Oh, what's happening? What? what are they sticking to me for? Bye, Jaden. Thanks for coming in. Be sure to check back over the next few days because I'll be opening up more Ninja Turtles. Oh, yeah. Boom, boom. Oh, get, get, it, get it off me. Get it off me. Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? Where is it? Uh, 
Hey, Speech Fairies, thanks for coming in. Thanks for the like. Yeah. How about tonight, Bells? How about tonight, Bells? Bells. Oh, my goodness. I just tied that balloon without even looking at it. Oh, get it, get it off me. Get, get, get it off me. These are attacking balloons. Oh, 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 thanks for your likes, though. Let's blow up one more. Hey, Nino, thanks for coming in. Thanks for giving the video a like. If you like killer balloons, give them a like. Oh, oh, get it. No, no, no. Oh! Ah! 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 Oh! God! Ah! Oh! Ah! Get them off me! Get them off me! Get them off me! Get them off me! Ah. Whew! Whew! Yeah. Jason, does a water balloons supposed to put water in those tiny balloons? That's why they're called water balloons. Oh, oops. Those were water balloons. Zuru makes a bunch of balloons. Um, Jason, doobie-doo, where are you? We got figures to review. Jason Booby Booby, where are you? I like your toys and likes. Thanks for your likes, guys. Oh, I forgot that we got that awesome ball. That's awesome soccer ball. All right. So I think I got them off me. <laughs> There's one here. Check out this guy. Ha, ah, he's here. Okay. Now what else am I going to open? You know what? I have lots of these LOLs. So I'm going to open up one of those. I've gotten lots of them. I have two of them sitting here. Which kinds are these? These are the pets. Does that mean that there's going to be poo in here? One of them shakes and one of them doesn't shake. I'm opening the one that shakes. What time is it? It's eight o'clock here. How long have I been recording this video? Almost an hour. Okay, that's a lot of toy opening. So this will be the last thing that I open. I have to like get ready for... I got a big day tomorrow. I have to actually leave the house to work. Oh, my first clue is... I don't even know what this is. It looks like a sticker Band-Aid. I'm... I don't know if I've ever opened up a pet. I think I remember some kind of kinetic sand poo box, if I am not mistaken. Maybe I opened a pet. I'm not sure. Use the magnifying glass. I don't think I need the magnifying glass this time. Oh, you're supposed to... Is it like a, a hunt, a search and find? Is that what we're doing? Oh, there's something in there. It's like... It looks like one of those things where... Where you... um When you're colorblind. And you have to look and you have to see a thing. Uh, oh, you were right. <laughs> you're right. You're always right, speech fairies. I see... I can't even make out what it is. I can't... Now I'm going cross-eyed. I see a seashell, I think. The clues never help me with anything anyway. I don't know. I don't even know why they, they include those. How come I didn't get anything this time? I didn't find anything in my second layer. Shouldn't I find something in my second layer? Is that how these things work? I don't see anything. And do you know what else? I can't even read them. Does that mean I'm colorblind? I can't read what that says. I can't read like that what that says. Do I need special glasses or something? I mean, do first of all, do I mean do I need special glasses? And secondly, do I mean do I need like 
special glasses to be able to read those things. All right, let's open this up. Oh yeah, there's a poo. There's a poo box. Oh yeah. Now they give you the special glasses after you open it. But I ripped up the packaging, so you can't. Does that make sense? What if you rip the stuff into, you can't even see it. Okay, now at least I can see what it says. It says, stinking cute. Maybe you have to have them left over from before. Okay, I've never seen this before. And this one says, wow, woof. This one says, woof. What? That's what perverted people say on YouTube all the time to me. All right. Next, we're just going to like open up these blind bags and see what's going on in here. I'm over it. This one says, oh, that's the one that said inappropriate stuff. This, it's kind of, oh, oh, wow. Oh, the LOL one looks really cool. Let's see if it works for you guys. See how you can't see it, you can't see it, you can't see it. You still can't see it. For me, it makes it really clear. That That's kind of magical. Wow, this is like me. Oh, read the clue? Okay. This is like me, like, playing with toys for the first time. It says... Am I getting really blind? Do I have to get better, even better glasses? It says, bombshell. Awesome. It was a picture of a bomb and a picture of a shell. So, that's why it was easy for me to guess that one. That's like the easiest LOL clue I ever got. I need my scissors. This is really hard to open. How do I know which thing I'm opening? They smell like Halloween masks. Oh, I'm opening the animal already. Oh my goodness. I have to take a look at this. Look at this. <laughs> it's another birdie. It's another dinosaur. So very well in theme with the toys today. It's cute. I like it a lot, and I've totally seen LOLs with hair like that, so I know it matches somebody out there. Really cute. I wonder if I bought all the ones that they had. I got these at Treasure Hunt, so I got a very good deal on them. I have to go digging in the poo box soon. And... Um, Okay, I don't support drinking soda pop, so never drink soda pop. It's really cool that they call it pop, though, because you guys call it soda in the States, and in Canada, we do call it pop. But I think in places that are close to the border, like I know in Detroit, they also call it pop. And some people call it soda pop. Maybe this is a clue because it kind of looks like an owl. Are all the magnifying glasses the same? I guess you're supposed to keep your magnified glass for the next time you open it. So this one, when I open up this one in the next video, we're going to see what's going on. I can't believe I said that this was the last thing that I'm going to open, but it's going to take a long time for me to finish it, isn't it? What else did I get in here? Uh-oh, this is going to come in handy. It's the poop scoop. They've really improved these. This must be series two of the pets. Because the pets that I opened were not this luxurious. I didn't have this much fun. This is a lot of fun. Okay, so next up, make sure that I don't lose anything, is a pair of sunglasses. Sunglasses on LOLs are kind of weird because they poke in so much. It always feels like you're going to break them or something. I don't know if this these are for the pet or you're supposed to save them for your toy. Are you supposed to save them for your little sister? Anyway, they look good on her. Real cute. Have you opened a confetti? LOL. They are fun. Um, is that is that what this is? I remember opening... Oh, no, a, a pick-me-pop. I didn't think it was fun, though, because I'm still picking up pieces of tinsel around my toy room. But I guess I haven't 
opened one of those. No. Okay, so that's oh, everything. I hope that's everything. I hope there's no sticker that I'm like crumbling up or anything. All right, except for except for the litter box that we have to go digging in. Okay. Is that a, did she did, did tell me nope that's a that ball is yellow. Oh, do I also have to see if it's rare? Okay, so I'll look for a yellow one and I'll definitely buy a yellow one. I mean, if I find them at Treasure Hunt, I'm going to buy every single one that I find. Actually, that's not true. I saw two of these, and I only bought one of them because they were $19. So that's a lot of money. But it was half price. It probably, if they were 60% off, I probably, no, I think they were 60% off that day. But then, you know, somebody else grabbed it. Um, um, um. Hey, this one says I squeak. The one that's with um the one that's with my little animal um owl is a I don't know what it is. I guess it's a hamster and it squeaks. Why are they in a group together? They're called the Retro Club. I guess the Retro Club is my favorite club. I don't know if that's true. Pets are all cute. Look at Catnap is adorable. How do I know if it's rare or not? Oh, here's the map. It says ultra rare is squeak is ultra rare. Mine is popular. Whatever. Sandbox looks really cool. Let's dig into the kinetic sand. Oh, and they've, this is a much better imprint than I saw before. Okay. Is there an easy way to do this? Can I just like dig my fingers in instead? Oh yeah. Oh, 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 wow. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my good. Oh, oh. I guess I'm. Oh! I've never played with kinetic sand before, guys. This is weird for me. It's crumbling in like spider web kind of way. Okay. She comes with a little bow. I kind of like that. It's kind of prissy. What else is in here? Is there just one thing in here? Is there more than one thing? This kinetic sand feels so weird. It's like spiderweb sand. Has anybody ever compared it to spiderwebs before? That's what it kind of reminds me of. Is there just one thing in the sand? That's all I'm finding. This is weird. This feels weird, guys. Real weird. Um, Ratch, the spy are like the ball that Jason is opening, but with the dolls. That is season four. You guys know more than me about this stuff. I don't know anything about this stuff. All I know is it's like spider webs. Spider webs and sand mixed together. Okay, do I have to worry about this drying out? How do you close this up? You stick that like that. Can she put on this necklace? Was this in her picture? Does it show you? It's good that it doesn't show you her with this on because that would give away what the special surprise is. Do you always get the same thing? There's a hole in her bum. That is disgusting. I don't get all this pooping and peeing fascination to tell you the truth. How do I get this on? Is this easy to get on? Is this hard to get on? I can't I can't get it on. Is this what you're supposed to do with it? You're supposed to just put it on her like this? Is that what she's supposed to wear? That doesn't really fit her. Some pee, some cry, and some color change. Oh, yeah. But they all have the holes. You just never know. Unless you pop their heads off. This one doesn't have a tube going into its head. So I guess that means that it doesn't pee. It doesn't have a tube going into its bum. And I never get them wet because I don't want water in my toys. So that's all your that's all she wrote. So if you want to see more Easter blind bag phenomena, 
Definitely come back and I'll probably have some more Easter toys as well. I'm glad that you guys joined me today. I don't know if you guys answered me and told me that there was only one toy in the kinetic sand um, or not. Apparently you didn't. It's usually shoes in the sand unless they have different feet. Kinetic sand doesn't dry out. Oh, Aram answered all my questions. Thank you, Aram. Um, cool. You rock, bro. No, you do, Nino. Thanks for coming in and joining me. Um, Nico Toys, thank you for also coming in and joining me today. I hope you liked all of the toys. Come back and let me know what the favorite thing that I opened today. I certainly opened a, a giant pile of stuff. Um, remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Love you guys so much. I'll see you again tomorrow. Hopefully, hopefully I don't get back too late by, because I'm buying way too many toys. Love you guys.